to release them. But I am, in fact, not chicken-like whatsoever. So as you can see, I have no choice. Yes, of course. What else could you have done? <sighs> While normally this would be a harmless prank, Fimblewinter prevented the stags from returning. And now they have long since scattered to parts unknown. It was worth it. Well then, what else, friends? Headed to the crater? There are still a few loose ends to tie up. Bound to be even more dangerous beasties with valuable resources. Works for me. Stag of winter. It looks hungry. Come on already. Just come back with me. I don't care how hungry you are. That's right. We got more food at home. Come on. I have to say, quite a nice change of pace helping these stags get home. For a moment, I was worried we'd have to kill them. Yes. You had a plan to kill it if it had attacked, didn't you? Yes. Halfway there by Septimus. I do not like you. I get that a lot. Two down, halfway there. Spring, time of rebirth, renewal. 
Oh, I've missed the smell of those flowers. I'm sorry, kid. Just come back already. Just one stag left. Thanks for saving the realms and all that. I'd have gotten to it myself, and with more style. But thanks. You're welcome. You mean to say. I'm surprised, brother. You'd think a stag would run in terror at the sight of you. Not exactly a calming presence, are you? I am always calm. Ha! <laughs> Good one. Wounded. We can end this. You come to hell, bro. On the run again. Think the blood will lead us to her den? Yes. Follow the blood. I suspect this will lead us back to that den we came across. Maybe once we get to her den, we can finally stop her. Pity. Do you admire her? She's terrorized this land, brother. This jungle was her home. She defended it the way she knew. But if death is the only dignity we can give her, we will give it.
Dishonored. Congratulations! You saved the nine rounds from death by overgrowth, and you sort of saved my ass, too. No one was really dead. This is false. That was not our aim. I'll take what I can get. A job well done. Might as well check in with Ratatoska when we've got the time. Fresh blood. Yeah, we're getting closer. <gasps> Tracks here. Let's see where they lead, brother. Those tracks are new. I think we're getting closer. We didn't have to kill her. Talk to me, I'm in the zone. The stags, the stags are, are returned. Better late than never. Incredible! The Nine Realms are no longer in horticultural danger. I cannot thank you enough. But perhaps this will suffice. Arrogant believes he has evaded punishment just because you fixed his blunder. He is sorely mistaken, of course. He will be in a remarkable amount of trouble. Once I figure out...
punish someone whose narcissism renders him invulnerable to all forms of emotional warfare. Now, what else might there be to discuss? There is one thing I'd like to know. Obviously, the time has come to talk about me. It most certainly has not. What? Why not? How dare you belittle my accomplishments? I apologize for arrogance. His volume has only increased over the years. And why shouldn't it? I single-handedly take care of the ding-dang world tree. Without your boy here, the realms would rot off the branches before you can say ingratitude. He does have a point. Tending to the world tree all on your own. It's no small task. Of course, he's got a point, my dear Mimir. But singing your own praises, it's awfully gauche, isn't it? Who the hell else is gonna sing them? <sighs> and your question was? Oh, I've utterly forgotten. Splendid. Until next time, then. I suppose I needn't take up more of your time. Yes, we'll be moving along to other things now, you hulking dingbat. <laughs>